Welcome, dear explorers, as we embark on a journey into the enigmatic world of the unseen and the unheard. Today, we delve into the mysterious realm of the Tao's hum, a low-frequency humming sound that has intrigued, baffled, and haunted the residents of Taos, New Mexico, for decades. This is not just a tale of an inexplicable sound phenomenon, but a philosophical exploration into the nature of perception, reality, and the mysteries that lie just beyond the edge of our understanding. Our journey begins with a question that has been at the heart of the Taos home mystery. If a sound is unheard, does it exist? This question, akin to the age-old philosophical query of the tree falling in the forest, has puzzled scientists, philosophers, and residents of Taos alike. At its core, the Taos hum is a low-frequency sound that only a small percentage of people can perceive. This elusive hum, described as a distant idling diesel engine or a buzzing refrigerator, is not just a local oddity, but a global phenomenon reported in various regions worldwide. Some hear it constantly, others only sporadically, and the rest not at all. This disparity in perception raises intriguing questions about the nature of reality and the reliability of our senses. The phenomenon of the Tao's hum also challenges our understanding of sound and silence. The human ear is not a passive receiver of sound, but an active filter that shapes our auditory experiences. If physical measurements fail to capture the hum, does it mean it doesn't exist, or does it simply exist beyond our current scientific understanding? On the other end of the spectrum, the psychological interpretation of the Taos hum posits it as a form of tinnitus or an auditory hallucination. However, this explanation does not fully account for the shared experiences of those who hear the hum or its specific geographical occurrences. Thus, the Taos hum continues to evade concrete explanation, straddling the line between the physical and psychological, the objective and subjective, the measurable and the unquantifiable. The enigma of the Taos hum has sparked interest from notable figures in various fields. Thomas Edison, the prolific inventor, once said, we don't know a millionth of one percent about anything, a sentiment that reflects our limited understanding of phenomena like the Tao's hum. Similarly, Albert Einstein's assertion that the most beautiful thing we can experience is the mysterious resonates deeply with the perplexing nature of the Tao's hum. In the realm of literature and film, the Tao's hum has found resonance. Dean Kuntz's novel Midnight features a mysterious hum that drives people into a violent frenzy, while in the film Pontypool, a strange sound triggers a bizarre and deadly epidemic. Both works explore the unsettling implications of unexplained auditory phenomena and the power of sound to disrupt our perception of reality. In the contemporary world, the Tao's hum continues to spark debates and discussions. Some argue it's a form of mass hysteria, or suggest it's a byproduct of military experiments. Others propose more esoteric explanations, such as alien transmissions or vibrations from the Earth's core. These divergent perspectives illustrate how the Tao's hum, like many unexplained phenomena, becomes a canvas onto which we project our anxieties, beliefs, and theories. The relevance of the Tao's hum lies not just in its auditory mystery, but in the broader philosophical questions it raises. It forces us to question our perception of reality, the reliability of our senses, and the limits of scientific understanding. As we advance into an era of increasing technological complexity, these questions become more pertinent reminding us of the mysteries that continue to elude our grasp. In the silence of the Taos night, beneath the vast New Mexico skies, the enigmatic hum persists, a sound at the edge of hearing, a whisper from the unknown. It reminds us that the world is full of mysteries, that reality is often stranger than fiction, and that the line between the seen and the unseen, the heard and the unheard, is thinner than we might think. I thank each one of you, dear explorers, for embarking on this philosophical journey with me. Your curiosity and engagement are the lifeblood of these explorations. I leave you with a few questions to ponder. Can we trust our senses to define reality? How do we grapple with phenomena that defy scientific explanation? 
and what other mysteries might lie just beyond the edge of our perception. As we conclude this journey, I invite you to carry the enigma of the Taos hum with you, a reminder of the beauty of the unknown, the allure of the mysterious, and the endless possibilities of exploration. Until our next philosophical expedition, keep exploring, keep questioning, and remember, the world is full of wonders waiting to be discovered.